book readings with Miss Bernard. Hello everyone and welcome to another book readings with Miss Bernard. Today's story is Thank You Mama. This book is inspired by the viral sensation on TikTok, Gray and Mama. Their adorable videos show the mother always handing little Gray healthy snacks and meals to eat and he's always showing gratitude and he always says, thank you mama. <laughs> Linda, the mom, decided to write a book sharing her son's loving gratitude in hopes of inspiring us all to be grateful. All right, let's begin. Thank you, Mama. Gray woke up to a familiar, funny feeling on his toes. Slurp, 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 slurp. Rambo! It must be morning, Gray thought. And morning means... Breakfast! Mama, can we have something special for breakfast? Gray asked. Oh yes, Mama said. Breakfast is my favorite meal. It's my favorite too, Gray cheered. What will we have? What's your favorite food for breakfast? Mama asked. Hmm, Gray thought. He loved toast with creamy bright green avocado on top. And he loved pancakes with whipped cream and fruit. But he also really likes cereal, and oatmeal, and eggs, and yogurt with bananas and strawberries. I don't know, Gray said. What is my favorite food, Mama? I can't tell you that, silly, Mama said. A favorite is something you decide for yourself. Are pancakes your favorite breakfast food? Mama asked. I like pancakes, Gray said but I don't know if they are my favorite. Let's make pancakes today, and then you can decide, Mama said. What should we put on top? Whipped cream and sprinkles, Gray said, and lots of sweet, juicy berries. Hooray for pancakes. Thank you, Mama. After breakfast, Gray and Rambo played pretend, but being a hero is hard work. Gray's stomach rumbled, tumbled, and grumbled. <laughs> Gray wondered what his favorite snack might be. After firefighter Gray saved the day, he asked Mama, May I have olives and pickles and chestnuts and cheese and some apples for Rambo? Of course, that's a good snack, Gray, Mama said. Mama gave Gray a plate filled with tart olives, sour pickles, buttery chestnuts, silky smooth cheese, and crisp apples. Thank you, Mama. We're going to eat it all up. Is this your favorite snack, Gray? Mama asked. Hmm. Gray thought as he chomped on a crunchy pickle. These foods were delicious, but he also liked salty, salted edamame, and leafy broccoli, and crispy seaweed, and flaky crackers with cheese, and sweet mangoes. Mmm, all those snacks are yummy. After a while, the rumbling, tumbling, grumbling sound returned. Gray thought of all the foods he liked for lunch. Mama, what's for lunch? Gray asked. Let's make a sandwich, Mama said. What kind would you like? Hmm, Gray thought. He loved peanut butter and jelly sandwiches and ham and cheese. And he especially liked tuna sandwiches. A tuna sandwich, Gray said. Is a tuna sandwich my favorite food, Mama? What do you think? Mama asked. Remember, you have to decide for yourself. Hmm. Gray thought as he chewed the tangy tuna salad and soft sweet bread. Was a tuna sandwich his favorite food? But what about bubble tea with mama? And donuts with dada? And egg rolls with nguai? And sushi with auntie? And apples with rambo? Later, as he and Rambo landed their ship, Captain Gray heard a strange sound. Was it a sea monster? 
No, it was Rambo's belly. <laughs> then Gray heard the rumble again, but it wasn't Rambo this time. <laughs> Mama, I think it's time for dinner, Gray said. I think you're right, Mama said. And for Dada, and why, and Auntie too. What's your favorite food for dinner? Mama asked. Hmm, Gray wondered. He loved brothy ramen, and he really liked salads with bright red tomatoes and sweet peppers that snapped in his teeth, and saucy noodles with tofu. Then there were spring rolls with delicious sweet and salty peanut sauce. He just couldn't decide what was his favorite food, what his favorite food was. I'm still not sure, Mama, Gray said, but can we have rice and fish for dinner and some seaweed? Of course we can. That's Nwai's favorite dinner, Mama said. Mama chopped green onions. Dada measured the rice. Nwai cooked the fish in a caramel glaze. Auntie cooked the veggies and Gray set the table. He brought a big bottle of spice for Mama, kimchi for Dada, lettuce and herbs for Nwai, and salty seaweed for Auntie. These must be their favorite foods, Gray thought. This is so yummy. Thank you, Mama. Thank you, Dada. Gam on, Nguai. Thank you, Auntie. I love dinner, Gray cheered. We had a lot of different foods today, Mama said. Did you decide your favorite? That's easy, Gray said. Right now, my favorite food is pineapple because my favorite food is anything I'm sharing with you or Dada or Nguai or Auntie or Rambo. Thank you, Gray. That is Mama's favorite food too. The end. Oh, what a cute story. And there, look, you can see there's Linda Mika and little Gray. <laughs> What a lovely story. All right, now I want you to leave a comment below and tell me one of your favorite foods. Throughout the book, Gray was trying to figure out what was his favorite breakfast food, what was his favorite snack, what was his favorite lunch food, and what was his favorite food for dinner? Go ahead and leave a comment below and tell me, hmm, what is your favorite food? All right, this has been another Book Readings with Miss Bernard. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. As always, have a wonderfully beautiful, awesome, and magnificent day. And remember, always be grateful. Bye-bye.